I'm going to enter a, a firing schedule into my kiln controller manually. And in order to do that, the first thing I do is I put it into my Insight Live account. So I've got a firing schedule here for cone 04 glaze where I'm going to fire to temperature, drop it 100 degrees, and soak it for half an hour. And I have four steps here. So the first thing to do is to make sure that my kiln controller is in idle mode and you can see it's displaying the temperature and then idle. So I just press the enter program button and it wants to know user. That means which program number do I want to put in. And most controllers have six programs. I'm going to put in number three. That's already right. So I'll press enter. And it's asking how many segments are in the firing. And there's four. That's correct. And now it wants to know ramp number one, RA ramp. How fast do I want it to go up? And I want it to go up 400 degrees an hour. That's correct. And to what temperature? 240. And I'm going to hold it for 60 minutes. So that's so I can dry out my pots. And then press enter. Now it wants to know ramp number two. I'm going to set it 400 up to 1805. And the hold is zero. The third step, I'm going to go at 108 degrees an hour. The reason I do that is because the Orton kiln chart, that's one of the rates of rise that they document. And then I'm going to go to 1905. And I'm going to hold it for 10 minutes. That's right. So you notice I just press enter when the number's already there. And the last ramp, 108 degrees an hour to 1805. So now I'm dropping in temperature and I'm going to hold it for 30 minutes. And then the alarm, I'll set it at 9999 so that it doesn't sound. Press enter. Program is in there. Complete. Now to start the kiln, I just press start.